Okay, guys, we are back. No fancy intro is needed because this is the end of the year. It's the end of 2023. And as you know, you're probably reflecting on the year and you're looking forward to your next year's goals. And I'm going to be honest with you guys. If this year did not go how you wanted it to go, it's because you're lacking knowledge. You're lacking direction and you need to know the right way to get where you want to go. And I know all of you watching this video, your first goal is $10,000 a month. It is the benchmark of business. It is the first thing that you should try to hit in order to get where you want to go further and to the millions and doing crazy cool stuff. So in this video, I'm going to show you no fluff, the best way to make $10,000 a month in 2024. I'm going to show you exactly how to get started. So watch to the very end, make sure you're not a little dopamine goblin and you actually pay attention. You guys hear me talk about remote closing and high ticket sales all the time, but there's one aspect of this whole genre that is way simpler and easier than anything else. And it is called appointment setting. And even within that, there's an even easier part called DM setting. So you have setting on the phone, which is like, hey, I saw you applied to this form. Hey, blah, 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 book a sales call, basically. And then you have DM setting, which is literally typing with your sticky little thumbs to get people to book on the calendar of whatever offer you work for. It is the single easiest way I have ever made money in my life, ever. Guys, I've seen brain dead 16 year old kids live on their mom's couch and still make thousands of dollars a month with this, okay? So let's jump in. I'm gonna use my friend Cardinal Mason as an example. Cardinal Mason sells a copywriting program. He teaches people how to become copywriters. And he has a really big TikTok and it's trickling down into his Instagram, his YouTube and everything, okay? So he's popping on social. So every day, Mason is gonna get DMs from people that are saying like, hey, how does copywriting work? Hey, how do I find my first client? Hey, can you help me? Can you mentor me? Um, this copywriting question, that copywriting question, whatever. And Mason obviously does not have time to respond to all of those himself. Those are all people that are interested in getting into his program. They're already asking about the business model. They're asking about the thing he teaches. So Mason will hire what is called a DM setter. He'll hire someone from me. He'll hire someone from one of our other friends that does sales coaching. And he will literally say, Hey kid, I want you to sit in my Instagram like you're me. And I want you to respond to people and tell them to book a call on this calendar and send them this link. That's it. That is the entire job of a DM setter. So you're basically having a conversation with people. So they'll DM you. They'll say, Hey, um, how does copywriting work? And you'll say, so basically, uh, people need marketing, but there's two kinds of marketing. There's like the eyeball marketing, but then there's the, the written words that's called copy. So you're going to write copy for people. We're going to show you how to get a client and then you're going to make a couple thousand dollars a month with your own copywriting agency, like whatever. That's it. Then they'll be like, Oh, it sounds awesome. You say, yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome. So, um, do you want to get on a call with one of our team members this week and, and talk about us helping you get started copywriting? Yeah, I'd love to Calendly link sent done. That's it. That's your whole freaking job. That's DM setting. It's the easiest thing I've ever seen in my life. And the cool thing about this is you're not like doing some like spammy kind of sales. Like they're coming to you. You're not cold DMing people. Okay. That's never going to be something that I recommend you do or that I teach people. You are responding to people that are messaging you. So they're saying, Hey, how does sales work, bro? Hey, how does copywriting work? Hey, how do I get into e-com? And you just have a conversation. If you can text, your friends, and if you have a funny group chat on your phone and you text people and you text jokes and you text girls, you can make three to five to even, I've seen $10,000 a month as a DM setter. So let's talk about making money. Well, we'll use Mason again. Mason's program is I think $5,000 and his setters, typically the whole like typical setter commission is gonna be like two to 3%. So a closer is usually gonna get 10%, a setter is gonna get two to 3%. So if you book a $10,000 offer and just halfway this with me, cause I'm so bad at math, you set people on a $10,000 offer. So if they buy, you make two to $300. Let's call it two. So I have easy round numbers. Okay. So you work for a $10,000 offer. You're typing. You want us to speak with a coach this week, whatever. They book a call in the calendar. Boom. They buy, they sign up, they join. Obviously you didn't do that. The closer closed them. You are going to make $200 for that for literally thumb, 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 $200. Sounds too good to be true. Cause it is. Why? It just is like you're making Mason so much money that he doesn't care to pay you $200. He's not going to try to nickel and dime you and be like, oh, no, you deserve 20, which in reality, it's like a $20 an hour job. But that's the beautiful thing about this business model and why you need to get your ass in gear and get on it in 2024, because I don't think it'll always be this way as everything gets more sophisticated. But right now you can make stupid, easy crybaby money without doing hardly anything because of this. And this is not even mentioning if you work for a client that does like launches or something, right? Like if you do a launch, like a big marketing push, oh my gosh, sometimes as a setter, you will set hundreds of thousands of dollars in a week for this client because they're doing like a big marketing push, right? Do the math on that. That's two to 3% you get paid, okay? That's absurd because all you're doing is typing. I just paid my DM setter last month, I think like $8,000. That's 
six figures a year. $8,300 is six figures a year. It's $120,000, I think, right? Or, or 100, whatever it is. That's absurd for just typing with your thumbs. Okay, so I've told you about it enough. It sounds cool. How do you actually do it? Well, here's how. The first thing is you need to go get a client. So the best way to do this is to start by setting up your profile correctly. Guys, Instagram or Facebook is going to be your best bet, or even honestly, Twitter, if you're on like money Twitter, that's going to be your best bet. So set up your profile well, set up a nice clean profile picture, set up a nice header. If you have a header on Twitter, set up a nice bio. Don't say appointment setter. Don't say high ticket closer. You're just Chad. You're just Chad. That's a cool guy. He looks like he's put together. He has cool hobbies. He has some cool pictures. He doesn't have anything stupid. You're just Chad. You don't want to be like, oh, I am an appointment setter. Don't identify as that. It's just what you do to make money. Next, we want to identify our ideal business owner. So who is going to be our Cardinal Mason in this example? Well, ideally, they have over 30,000 followers on whatever platform they're on. It could be Twitter. It could be TikTok. It could be Instagram. It could be even Facebook groups, right? Or these new school groups. One of those that all we want to look for is that follower count. So we know, okay, they get good lead flow. Next, they have a link in their bio. So you want to make sure they sell a high ticket offer. So you don't want like where you can go click in their bio and then buy something for $50. You don't want that. You want apply, sign up, join free class, book a call, something like that, because that means they're getting on a sales call, which means they need setters. OK, if I can just go to your link in bio and buy this thing for 500 bucks, I don't need an appointment setter at that point because you can just check out with a credit card. So you want to find a apply button, not a buy button. And then another little tip for you guys is they have like good respect to mutuals. So like if you go to my profile, I have Iman, Sebastian, like big guys. And obviously I say this like in a funny way because these are my friends, but these are big guys that are like well-respected in our space. So if you go to their profile and no one that's like respected in the in the game follows them, maybe it's for a reason, right? Like this Richard Yu guy who also tries to teach appointment setting is a weirdo and watches porn all day. Anyway, he is not respected in the space at all. I know I don't throw people under the bus, but I'm using this as an example because it's just so gross, the shit I've seen. He's not respected. No one that I am around likes to associate themselves with the guy because it's slimy, scammy stuff, okay? So don't work for people like that. Work for people that are respected. They do good business. They do things the right way. Next, we want to start sending outreach messages to get clients. The best way that I found to do outreach messages is not say, hey, me, 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 I would love to do this, blah, blah. That's not the best way. The best way is, in fact, to reach out and say, hey, let's just say John. Hey, John, I love your stuff. I've been following you for a long time. I know you get a ton of DMs. If you don't have anyone right now that is like responding to DMs for you and book them on your calendar, I would love to be that guy that can do that for you. Let me know if you have room for that. Short and sweet, done. If you send that to 100 people, 500 people, I guarantee you guys you're going to get a client. And if you're honestly, if you have room temperature IQ, you will make thousands of dollars. So by sending these DMs, that's the hard work you're doing to make the money. Okay, so send DMs, do that and it will work. Also, follow up. Don't just keep sending these messages forever. Like follow up with people. Hey, John, uh, just bumping this up. I know you're super, super busy guy. I just watched your podcast you just did with Greg and uh, it was really cool. It was good shit whatever, just something like that. Then the day that they respond, don't freak out. You're going to get a response. And one day someone's going to be like, okay, oh, I'm in. You're, you're going to freak out. That's just the interview. So basically, sometimes they won't even interview you, to be honest, because it's such an easy job. But basically, all that's going to happen is they're going to get you on a call. You're just going to show up, be yourself, be confident. Hey, man, yeah, maybe I'm I'm new. Like, be honest, right? Hey, I'm new. But like between you and I, we both know this is the easiest thing ever. Um, I'll make sure I represent your brand well. I will never say anything crazy over DM. And you can monitor me for the first month or whatever. But I, I literally just want to set appointments for you. If you say something like that and you show up and you're professional, you're respectable, you're nice, you're going to get the job. And then you pass that interview and you have landed a gold mine offer and you are going to be making commissions. Guys, it's that easy. DM setting works the same way as getting a closing client or getting a phone setting client, but it is the easiest thing ever. You might not make as much as a closer. You're not going to make 30 grand in a month, more than likely, but you will make more than I think the average like salary in the US is like that. No matter if you're 16 years old, if you're 25 years old, it doesn't matter. So it's the end of the year. Everyone is like forming new goals and they're like, hey, well, I didn't hit where I wanted to go this year, but it's because this, this and this. Fuck that. Okay. 
You are not where you want to be because you don't do the right things. The definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over and over and over again and expecting a different result. So if this year did not go how you wanted and you did not make the money you wanted to make, you didn't make 10K a month, you need to look at yourself with some honesty and self-reflect and say, you know what? Maybe I don't know what I'm doing and maybe I do need some help, okay? And if you want that help, we are running a special for the rest of the year. If you join Closer Cartel, my sales training program where I literally am going to show you how to do this every day. We have the best results in the whole industry. Kids making 20, 30K a month. All you got to do is shoot me a message, or I think there's a link in the description of this video. Shoot me a message and be like, yo, I want to join. I'm going to give you guys live calls with me every week until Christmas, just for joining for a holiday special to give you like a personal roadmap. Hey, here's exactly what to do. I, I will literally give you guys my time, hours of my time, which I charge a lot of money for outside of that. Okay. So guys, it's insanity to do the same thing over and over and over and expect a different result. So if what you've been doing hasn't worked, maybe it's time to change things up. And I would love to help you guys do so. If not, just use these free videos and actually put them to use. Okay. So God bless you all. I hope you like the new style of content. We're back at the desk, but it's a little different. We're switching it up and I'm trying to be a bit more, uh, I guess me with you guys. So I hope you like it. Please, please, please let me know how you like this video, like comment, subscribe, all that stuff. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.